Alright guys, this is working off of uh, the video my little brother Royal did. It's uh, underwater fireworks. Alright. What you gonna need for this experiment is an eyedropper, a clear glass, uh, clear glass of water, a cup for your vegetable oil, and food colorings. Oh, and a fork. And remember, get your parents' permission before you do any of these experiments. Alright, so you're gonna start by pouring the vegetable oil into your cup. About a teaspoon. I get your food coloring, put a couple drops of each color. Okay, that's one lump. Oh, I see it. And notice how all the food coloring is falling right to the bottom of the cup. I see the cup. I know. Let me use the fork. We're gonna stir it all up. What we're gonna do is gonna break up the particles of the food coloring. All right. See how I do that? And it just makes really smaller dots. That's what you're going for. Stir it for a couple seconds. All right. And then you're gonna take your eyedropper. You're gonna get some of that up in there, and you're gonna drop it down here in the water. Do that, do that a couple times. I see a cup. Oh, I see. <clears throat> All right, now if you watch it, the food coloring starts falling to the bottom. And right, the reason behind this is the food coloring is denser than the water. All right, but it's also denser than the vegetable oil that sits at the top because that's less dense than the water. Alright. And it makes all these cool little squigglies on its way down and it looks like fireworks. That's why it's called underwater fireworks. Mmm. It's firework water. It's firework water. Mm-hmm. There's fireworks in the water, see? It's like all if we boil. It's going on the way. Bye bye. That's pretty cool. Going on the way. It's going on the way. It's going on the way. Alright. Alright, guys, that's all the time we got for today. And remember, you're never too old for science, and it's not magic, it's science.